Good morning, everybody. I bet you didn't expect to see a video like this on the channel ever again. But, you know, I've had a few subscribers ask me to revive the Weekends with Wally series, and I thought about doing it for some time. So I thought, hey, summer's right here now. It's knocking on the door. It's Memorial Day weekend, and there's just no better place to be able to revive it than here at North Park. Even that bird agrees. <laughs> anyway, I'm about 20 minutes away from home, and I'm in Allison Park where North Park is. If you ever saw the original series, I, I did a video here a few years ago, and, you know, the only reason I'm not sitting at the deck where I would normally be is because there's some people over there fishing, some kids and their friends over there having a nice evening. So I'm sitting over here on this bench close to the boathouse, just enjoying this evening here out by the lake. And it's just so peaceful out here and scenic and beautiful. You almost forget that you're as close as you are to Pittsburgh. Um, Allegheny County is known for having some county parks like this. South Park is another one, but this one here is fantastic. Uh, I grew up coming here with my, my dad, and we would fish here all the time, and, you know, I would bring my bike out here, and even when I got old enough to drive, I'd come out here by myself and bring my bike out here to ride around. And even though it's been a little while since I've done it, I still come out here from time to time, and I don't know why I don't come out here more. I should. It's so close to home. You know, I have an inflatable boat I can take out onto the water whenever I want. You can rent kayaks or little boats here, and I, I just never do it. I, I think it's because I want to explore other places in the world, and with me doing the state park videos that I'm doing for Pennsylvania, I like to be able to explore all these other places I haven't been to, whereas I know this is always in my backyard, and I can come here whenever I want to, but... You know, after work today, it was just such a beautiful day. I went to Permanis in Ross Township to have a nice yummy dinner. That's my hangout if you're ever in Ross Township. Just look for the bee, friend, and you'll know I'm inside. <laughs> but I wanted to come out here because I wasn't ready to go home yet just because of how nice it is. So here I am sitting here by the boathouse on this nice new bench right by the waterside just taking in a nice early summer evening. So let me show you the lake from right here. Got all these flowers here. The boathouse is back there, hidden behind the trees. Let me step down here a little bit. Now you can see it. It's just beyond these trees back here. A couple of docks here where you can rent some boats. And there's actually a launch right over there, too. You can launch a boat out. That's where I've launched my inflatable boat out in the past. Now, the one I had, I had to toss because it had a hole in it. And it was too big to repair. I think uh, some mice might have gotten into it. But I ended up buying a new one. And now that it's at my place, I don't have to worry about that happening. And I'll take it back out here one day and give you guys a video. But it's about 8.30 on a, well, it's Monday night, actually, the week of Memorial Day is exactly seven days away when I'm doing this video. But with other obligations this week, I don't know if I'll be able to come back out here because I have Bowling League Thursday. I have to take a trip. Uh, up to Hermitage on Tuesday. Wednesday would be a good day, and then Friday I'm heading out to South Carolina. So when you're seeing this video, I'm in South Carolina enjoying the beach. <laughs> but anyway, I'll be quiet for a moment so you can enjoy the sounds of nature and passing cars and other people talking.
that's where I've been sitting. And actually, since I got up here, the deck emptied out. So I'm going to go over to my favorite spot. Yeah, this spot over here was the spot for my dad and I to go fish. Uh, we came here hundreds of times over my life and his and oh wow I see they're putting a they're putting another bench in right here that's what that orange tape is for I was wondering because that's what they did over there they poured some concrete and then put a park bench there so that's really cool that they're going to have another one there and I noticed some new trees here with the fences around them too to help them grow oh this bench is new this wasn't here before wow they really fixed this up nice yeah, that's new. This bench here is new. That bench over there is new. The geese aren't new. They've been here. They've been hanging out here all the time. Look how many they are. Look how many there are. I can't even talk. And then here's the parking lot here. Now, this is for handicap uh, parking only. That's why I'm parked way over where I am. But my dad, he had a placard, so we would park here. And when we were growing up they this wasn't a hundred percent handicap parking so we were allowed to they even have a little portage on there too to make it easy but the boathouse behind me has restrooms and just on the other side of the parking lot there's restrooms as well but here we are at my favorite spot there's the boathouse it's beautiful out here Look at how many hungry goose friends there are behind me. There's so many of them. And uh, thankfully, I'm far enough away from them that I hope I don't make them mad at me and just randomly attack me or bulldoze me or whatever and injure me. You're not going to poop on me, are you? Any of you? Y you? No. All right, I guess we're good. There's so many of them. And this is why there's goose poop here all the time. I remember when my family was this big. <laughs> my aunt would have cookouts, especially for Memorial Day, because her birthday is actually this weekend. And, well, in mid middle of the week, but she's going to be celebrating it this weekend. But we would have such big cookouts and parties at her house, you'd have to take roll call to make sure everybody's there. Like a classroom. <laughs> Just listen to them working their mouths in the grass. <laughs> their beaks, I should say. So this picnic bench we would sit at, have our tackle boxes, maybe some breakfast, a radio. We'd sit here all the time. And these metal poles, that one finally broke. If you remember the video I did years ago, that was bent, but it was still attached. Now the plastic fishing rod holders, they're all missing their the, the holders. I don't know if they were taken off for the winter time, but I would imagine since it's been fishing season that they would be put back on. Unless people broke them, which is a darn shame. Because that ruins it for everybody else. But that's okay. I worry enough that I would probably just sit on the bench or a camping chair and just hold my rod. Just waiting for that first bite. And wow, look at the water over here. It's really ripply. <laughs> but yeah, it's absolutely gorgeous out here as the sun sets on this evening. And get ready for another beautiful day out here of course while I'm working I like whoever put the the the, the stick into the fishing rod holder <laughs> North Park was actually the place I had my graduation party in 2006 when I graduated high school. 
and uh, it was a lot of fun. I just remember everybody that was there. All of my friends from the drum line were there. My aunt, my uncle, all our family members, and boy, what I would do to go back all those years, go back 18 years now to that, and just be able to hug everybody that's no longer here. <sighs> Sad, but you know, if I'm able to, you know, remember those good times and create new memories, it's just by coming out here and just enjoying the place. And it, it just stinks being alone, but I know Kate will be here in due time anyway. I know Kate wants to be here so badly, and people have asked, and yeah, I'm happily taken, and you know, Kate and I are just really happy together, and she wishes she could be here tonight, but she can't be, but soon enough. And in the meantime, I'm just going to enjoy it like it is, and just look forward to the future, and well... I'm happy to be back doing these morning videos like this on the weekends. Now, with me doing state park videos, um, I might do a state park video on Saturday and then do these on Sunday or vice versa. Uh, we'll see for now. Um, perhaps when I know I'm not going to have a state park video up for the weekend, maybe I'll do two morning episodes like this. And uh, oh my gosh, look at all the geese. They're all going out into the water. <laughs> They're all taking off into the water. A bunch of them have already gone out and like, look, it's follow the leader. <laughs> look at them all going. Enjoy your swim, friends. Don't poop on me. And don't kick my butt. I saw this meme recently of a golfer who was just golfing away and all of a sudden a Canadian goose just goes and just destroys them <laughs> on the course <laughs> look at them all taking sips of water you sure you want to drink that maybe that's why you poop out landmines all over the place just kidding is that how's the water is it cold well, you're not talking eh all right you hear the frog? <laughs> Look at all these two just got in the water and they're like, that's good enough. We're just going to be armed guard now for security. Security of the shoreline. And then their friends are like, we ain't waiting around for you. We'll see you later. <laughs> Enjoy your skinny dip, or should I say your chunky dunk? Speaking of chunky dunk, if anybody's chunky dunking, it's me. I'll jump in this water and make all the water jump out of the lake. <laughs> talk about a tsunami <laughs> oh anyway i guess i'll wrap it up because it is starting to get dark and i do have to do a few things when i get home before bed so like laundry and well stay tuned this is just the beginning of a new revival here of the weekends with wally series and it's going to be fun doing this we're just going to start off a new counter this is going to be episode one and Wow. I'm happy to be back here, and I'm happy to have you here if you're watching. This is going to be fun. And don't worry, I mentioned that boat. I can't wait to get that boat out on the water. It's just every weekend so far, something has been planned or coming up where I just can't do it. So, it's coming. Trust me. I'm going to have my boat out on this lake, and I will do a video, and I'm going to have it out on other lakes, too. Especially at state parks that I film that I haven't done videos at yet. Um, and I'm going to be camping. I have a lot of activities planned. I'm just always keeping busy. And as somebody that loves the outdoors and wants to be outdoors more than anything, I can't wait to camp. I can't wait to be out on the lake doing these videos. And 
I just wish I had more time, but I work full time, so it's hard for me to be able to do that. And with other videos that I do throughout the week for you all, I'm just always keeping busy. You know, if I'm not working full time at my regular job, I'm doing full time on this on YouTube for you guys. I'm always trying to pump out content for you because I feel if I can make your day a little bit better, I want to darn well try because life's too short and I thoroughly enjoy doing these videos. If I didn't enjoy it, I wouldn't be doing them. So <sighs> it's going to be a busy summer. So buckle up, baby. We're just getting started. Memorial Day weekend. Let's go. And with that said, if you have the extra long weekend for Memorial Day, what was, what was that? <laughs> if you have an extra long weekend for Memorial Day like I do, you know, make the best of your weekend. Even if it's raining, do something you like to do that's fun, even if you have to do it indoors. But enjoy yourself. Be safe, for starters. Just be safe out there. Don't do anything to get yourself in trouble or hurt or anything just have fun and remember for all of our united states friends here remember why we have this extra long weekend and the unofficial start to summer it's my favorite weekend to start besides discover presque isle but remember why we have this weekend it's because of our armed forces the members of our armed forces and military that paid the ultimate sacrifice for us to have our freedom be able to do things like this so, the geese are having a little bit of fun. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, remember why we have this weekend in the first place. Members of our military paid the ultimate sacrifice, and if it wasn't for them, we wouldn't be here being able to do this or watch the geese have some fun. <laughs> Probably trying to catch some fish. Oh my gosh! Anyway, yeah, if you see anybody in the armed forces, you know, you know, whether they're uniformed or not, remember to thank them for their service. I try to do it every time I can. And for you guys, for any of you people that have been members of our military or armed services or actively are, thank you for what you do. Thank you for making things like this possible for all of us. We couldn't do this without you, so. But anyway... I guess it's time to sign off. It's getting a little dark out here now. I hope you enjoyed this. Welcome back to Weekends with Wally. I can't wait to do this again soon, so stay tuned. And hey, if I have the chance to do more episodes, I will certainly do that. So anyway, I'm signing off. Hope you have a great Memorial Day weekend. If you're in South Carolina, somewhere along the shoreline there of the beaches, not quite sure where I'm going yet. I don't know if it's going to be like Charleston or like Folly Beach or Polly's Island or whatever. It's going to be somewhere along the, the lines there. But if you're out there and you see the bee friend or if you just see me, because I don't know if I'll even have the bee friend with me. But either way, if you see me, say hi. Anyway, I'm going to wrap up this video. Thanks for watching, everybody. Take care and stay awesome. Happy Memorial Day, and thank you to all of the members of our armed services for what you do every single day and what you have done in the past. Take care and stay awesome. Bye, everyone.